Governments should turn to 5G to help stop global warming. Can tech stop climate change? We've long known our industrial activities would cause the planet to overheat. A Swedish scientist, Arvid Högbom, concluded in 1896 that carbon emissions from coal burning would eventually warm the Earth. Fast forward 120 years and it's clear that he was right. In 2016, 194 governments and the European Union signed the United Nations Paris Agreement to limit the warming of the planet. The Paris Agreement says we should keep the Earth's average temperature to well below 2 degrees Celsius above pre-industrial levels. But if we can reduce it to 1.5 degrees Celsius, even better. So how do we get emissions down? Well, every industry causes its fair share, some more than others. The tech industry is no exception. Data storage centers, for instance, are large consumers of electricity. So how will we cope with the growing amount of data in the world, forecast to grow from 33 zettabytes in 2019 to 175 zettabytes by 2025? This is where 5G technology comes in. Thanks to 5G's incredible data transfer speeds, 5G's power consumption per bit is just 10% of that used by 4G. So 5G should help avoid CO2 emissions rather than increase them. Not only that, 5G networks support a whole range of climate change mitigation strategies in other sectors such as transport, agriculture, energy, to name but a few. 5G is ideal for fighting climate change. Use it now. There's no time to waste.